The other breaking news that we've had this morning in the business world, the surprise shakeup at one of Canada's biggest cannabis companies, Scott Peterson tracking the departure of Bruce Linton. And, and Scott, we're learning more about why he's out the door. Yeah, whether he was stepped down, whether he was fired, but if we take a look, he's been with this company since 2014 with a valuation going up 2,000% for that stock since that time. There he is there, a poster boy, really, you could say, for the company, sort of bringing it into the world of legalized cannabis cannabis but just a few moments ago on CNBC he in fact confirmed that he didn't step down at all that he was fired here he is and taking some questions some from some familiar faces as well the board had decided they wanted a different chair and a different co-CEO so I'm out uh, effective immediately and uh, there's a search to uh, replace the transitioning co-CEO Bruce just to be clear um have you been terminated or did you step down on your own? And I, I was terminated. Okay. So you were fired. So okay. you're, yeah, you're there's fired. a lot of words for it. And so there was a lot of words for it, an understatement of what happens in Mr. Linton. But Constellation Brands bought uh, into the company for $5 billion on the condition that he went on to explain that they would have a say on who was on the board of directors and who was leading the company. And clearly he's indicating that that was what was behind this decision. Also, Constellation Brands not happy about the fourth quarter loss. There was about a $330 million loss, a big surprise. Constellation Brands signaled it was not pleased. So this ends the career of Bruce Linton and he's been with the company since the beginning 2014 when they launched an IPO at closing at about two dollars and change back then now over fifty dollars and so there's a 17.5 billion dollar uh, valuation on his company it is the most valuable cannabis company not just in Canada but in the world Heather just uh, one point Scott want to make clear Kevin O'Leary who used to be of course on our program you heard him there he was on CNBC he works for that American network now asking yeah. the questions uh, of Bruce Linton uh, that we were just playing just uh, people wondering what that was all about so that was just earlier this morning in terms of um, his explanation. What about reaction to that on Bay Streets and Wall Street? Well, there's that old standard saying that uh, Bay Street, Wall Street, the markets do not like surprise, and this was a big surprise. So we're seeing the stock coming down about 5% in trading with a lot of questions as to who's going to be appointed. We know the CEO already, but there's going to be a big shake up here. Constellation Brands saying that they fully support the new CEO and that the future remains very bright for canopy growth, but you would expect them to say that as a minority shareholder at the same time.